lift your hands up. I declare that is born and believed that garment of spiritual dryness, garment of addiction, bondage of iniquity, garment of infirmity, of sickness, of disease, ancestral inherited bloodline disease, garment of singleness, inability to get married. Garment of fruitlessness, inability to bring forth children. Garment of empty handedness and scarcity, shortage. Garment of shame, reproach, disgrace. Garment of rejection, disfavor. Garment of misfortune. Garment of mourning, garment of death. Today, I speak by the mantle of God upon my life. I declare these garments are set on fire. In the name of Jesus. I speak the release of a new garment. You sleep overnight and you wake up and the garment is changed. Lady with a name that starts with an S ends with an E. I decree today the reproach has come to an end. I decree today the insult is over. It is not a crime that you had a child and decided that you will not remove the child illegally. You did the right thing. But I decree today that Jehovah will turn around your story and let people know that you did not do the wrong thing. Divine intervention. I declare the healing of the knees right now, whoever that person is, more on the right. I arrest the spirit of insanity, hearing of voices. Lose your grip of this Mahashadagaya in the name of Jesus. And the voices are suicidal. Life is not worth living. Just kill yourself. Take your life. I take authority over that suicide spirit of insanity. Lose your grip on the ear right now. Lady starts with a name that has an R. I take authority over that devil. Go to hell in the name of Jesus. Any other person in that category. Last time you heard that sound shall be the last. Somebody is battling with a, a driving license situation. Whether you are trying doing a driving test think it's somewhere in UK or US or something battling with and that is tied to something you need to get I declare today that the test is successful grace to pass that test is released right now I take authority over tyroglossacist I set it on fire I command it to melt I take authority over the garment of fruitlessness I set it on fire in the name of Jesus I hear twin. I, I think somebody is trusting God for twin gestation tonight. Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Receive your twins now in the name of Jesus. And I also see a set of twins that are stranded. Twin girls. Like Badarana Tese Koda Layat in the 20s, thereabout, or early 30s. I take authority over that spell of the enemy that tied your life down. The spell is broken. In the name of Jesus, someone having a left ovarian cyst situation, it looks like it is degenerated and having pain, the left ovarian cyst. I declare today divine intervention in the name of Jesus. Blood fallopian tube also. I declare it open right now. A child that became deaf, dumb suddenly, is not speaking suddenly. I take authority over that arrow of dumbness. I send it back to hell in the name of Jesus. Somebody looks like you inhaled something. When I say gaseous inhalation or something that is inflaming your system, side by side with that is an ingestion of poison. I take authority over that death that the devil sent your way and I declare it flushed out of your system right now. And every other person connected on this platform tonight that is having an arrow of death or death in your loved ones, I declare the arrow is retrieved and refired back to hell in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, because it is done. In Jesus' precious name. The exercise I told you to do, don't forget it. You put it in writing. Whatever garment you think is on your body, garment of reproach, you set it on fire tonight. 
and because you are going to testify lift up your hands and your voice and speak to God and just appreciate him pray in the spirit Go ahead and pray. Father, we give you the praise. Father, we give you the praise. Amen. Father, we give you the honor. Thank you, Something Jesus. happened to you already, and your life will never be the same. One of the most important, the most important event that happened since the commanding the day midnight prayer started is a one-year anniversary that is coming. It is the mother of all garments of favor. It's the mother of all 200 days of command the day, 100 days, 300 days. It's going to be a mega blast. On a daily basis, we are counting down. I think we are on day 9 now. And so please share the link on your pages. We are going to have publicity here and there and invite the whole world to join us 22nd slash 23rd of October commanded the day midnight prayer one year exactly we trust the Lord that God will give us a one year anniversary gift answer to prayers that will be eruptive all over the world inform your friends ahead of time and let us all get said for that the Lord bless you in Jesus name tomorrow we shall be in the services and then hear reports from Tanzania, from Malawi, all the incredible things that God did. We did a rural outreach in Malawi, went to a village, did medical outreach, did um, food supplies and preached the gospel, led them to Christ. It was incredible. You will take a look at it. <laughs> I think to me that was the most interesting part of the, of the, of the trip for me. Hallelujah. Faithful, faithful, faithful God. The earth is being filled with the knowledge of the glory of the Lord as the waters cover the seas. Thank you, Master, and thank you, Adonai, in Jesus' name. Anybody excited? Shout the Lord and say, Amen. Tomorrow night is the night of the Spirit. Night of the Holy Ghost. What does that mean to you? When you come, you will know. It's a revival night. It's a fire night. It's a night where those who haven't seen will see and those who haven't heard will hear. It's a night of pressing in the spirit and seeing things and hearing things and receiving things. It's a night where the Holy Spirit will help our infirmities and handle our weaknesses. So ensure that you invite your friends and loved ones. If you are not baptized with the Holy Ghost, with the evidence of speaking in tongues, get set for tomorrow night. If there are gifts of the Spirit in your life that you need to be reactivated, get set for tomorrow night. 
And if there are things in your life that are missing in the spirit, also get ready for them tomorrow night. God bless you and God keep you. Cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. 2024. And above only. Where is your place? And above only. Go ahead and give the Lord a praise and a shout of victory. Hallelujah. Celebrations. Just one moment. Everywhere you are watching all over the world, you need to surrender to Jesus. You need your sins forgiven and you need to today to make a new day. Pray this prayer after me. And say, Lord Jesus, I am a sinner in need of your help. Come into my life and make me a new person. Today I have decided to follow you, Lord. No turning back. Forward ever, backward never. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. I'm sure you meant that prayer. The Lord bless you. Let us know that you prayed. Stretch your two hands in front of you. I prophesy upon your hands. Your harvest will look for you from the north, the south, the east, and the west. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Hallelujah. God bless you. Let us know you pray the prayer. And go ahead and honor God with your offerings, tithes, and pledges. God bless you. We look forward to hearing from you. See you in service tomorrow. Let's go.